Good day, everyone, and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. We strongly recommend you to stay on a sim as long as needed. Before uh, you go live, you need to understand there is a high risk in the future trading. Uh, we're going to cover three different, actually four different type of an auto trade. Uh, the first auto trade is uh, the, the signal. And on the signal, we, you can use a one minute. On the left upper corner, you can see this is the market analyzer based on one contract and all those numbers based on the last entry signal for today. As an example, uh, we had an entry at 3648.25, target 37.04 on the last entry signal, not the whole day, the last entry signal. 169 on the YM 348 based on one contract NASDAQ 585 takes based on one contract scalper we have 180 takes this is the scalper also the same auto trade but we use a scalper on the scalper we are 180 100 200 takes based on one contract 16 takes on the es 21 takes on the nasdaq ym you don't have to trade all of them you can take three or four of them as an example you can take one es one nasdaq one ym and one cl if you like or if you wanted to just take a micro account es micro account nasdaq micro account YM and you can tra trade the swing trading or the scalping. Right now we wanted to uh, cover uh, a total different automated to trade. Uh, it is, uh, look at this one, it's beautiful today. It is long all the way uh, and now we are hitting the double resistance at 36.93.75 on the ES. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful a trend today is only long on the ES. Uh, we will be covering the TI7 is a total different strategy, fully automated, has nothing to do with the signal. It's a total different automated trade is in your package. The TI7, you can scalp, you can swing trade, you can do in between, you can trade micro account, you can trade four contracts, you can trade one contract, you can trade 10 contracts with a big uh, variety of entry and filter where you set the rules for that uh, auto trade to work the way you want it to be. And then, as you see what we, I will go through those charts. We don't have to hide behind a ranker bar or a range bar or uh, a line break or tick chart is a very simple when you have consistency is only minutes when the auto trade is good is only works on one minute because your chart on ninja trader is in minute and the rest is rubbish so that's why you don't see too many auto trades run on minutes and for for one reason because they don't work on one minutes and when they don't work on minutes that's mean they are not good auto trade. That's why you see they have to hide it with rank bar, line break, uh, tick chart, one day 220, another day 380, because there is no consistency. So you see switching time frame. You can use those auto trades on range bar. You can use those auto trades on a tick chart. You can use them on a rank bar. There is no big deal. But to show, we want to show that one minute, two minute, as an aggressive trader, you can choose between one to five. In other words, one minute is an aggressive, you know, medium, medium, high, low. Um, so you have one or two minutes for an aggressive trader, two, three minutes for a medium trader, not aggressive and not conservative, and four and five minutes for conservative trader. This is it. Because on the one minute, you're going to have a lot of noises. The market is going to go in and out. Plus, you can swing trade this auto trade, fully automated. You can scalp fully automated. 
I just made the, a new one. I have not, uh, um, tomorrow is gonna go to work, uh, this one here. And uh, this one here is between a scalping and, um, uh, but tomorrow is gonna be in order. That's why you see different colors for different accounts. But this one here tomorrow is gonna go uh, for the market. So you can do whatever you want. You can cut off a lot of trades. You can uh, filter a lot of trades. You can be aggressive uh, uh, with a non-stop trading. So you can tweak that auto trade the way you want to be tweaked. And it depends because you have one guy have $2,000, another guy have 4,000. One guy is have a few years under his belt and the other guy is just a disaster trader. So there is not one size of shoe fits all. So there is a big variety of entries on the TI-7 and filter for the beginners and the aggressive and the conservative and the ones have uh, some experience they can uh, tweak that auto trade the way they want it and of course uh, we help we provide templates but also we expect in you uh, we we drag you to a webinar on every monday after the new year eve and we will talk about auto trades auto trades auto trades until everyone got it and you can ask any question you want uh, uh, doing that uh, session. So this one here uh, is going to be on tomorrow. And uh, I'm very happy with it as well. Uh, I set this one here as an automatic without using any trailing stop, stop loss. Let the system uh, calculate step by step and uh, trying to get as much as I can out of it. And it's a bit aggressive, but uh, in no time you hit the target and I made it uh, based on two two lots. And it is between a swing trading and a scalping, it's in between. So this one here is fully automated and you don't have to even to set the trend and stop, which probably I will share it to our members uh, after New Year Eve, after testing it. So as we see here also, there is a lot of stop loss and trailing stops. The reason is we separated the trailing stop, the stop loss, the target, we separate them. So in the same time, we give you an extra button on the top where you can hold close position, long only, short only. In the same time, if you wanna add our FIB zone on it, you can increase, decrease your target. So in a way, if you wanna interfere with it, you can. And if you don't wanna mess with it, most of the guys, they auto trade, they're, they're scared to touch uh, the chart. But for the guys who are experienced enough, they don't mind if they wanna drag the target or they wanna go and take the target to a higher level where there is a FIB, like what I have showed you on the ES. It was a double. So this is uh, one of them. As, as an example here, you see, our numbers on the left bottom corner, they are not a fake numbers like what I have seen before. Those numbers are real. Those numbers are from the previous trades. And as you see on the previous trade, it was 1,655 and we have 1,000 here. So right now we have 1,000 out and 1,655 in by just go ahead and close the button here and we close if you want to overwrite it and then you can see it is 2735 closed the ym on five minutes so those numbers are real not fake number like what i have seen uh, on some other channels those numbers are for real and they are there showing you not fake number what happened 20 days ago what happened on the previous trade it shows on your box so this is a very important to uh, not get lost between fake numbers and the real numbers uh, nasdaq one minute 14 10 hit the target all of them the one above 1,000, they are on $1,000 trade. This one here, look. 
our daily target on this one here is 1000 and we had a lot of a small trade and a closed trade because it does automatically also if you want to if the market not going to your direction 945 in 250 out close position immediately you can close position and a close position at 1185 immediately so those numbers are real they're not fake like some other do this one here it is done and there is one more trade going in 1330 if we look at those charts all of them one minute two minutes three minutes four minutes five minutes only there is not much CL four minutes thousand uh, uh, the daily target is 1000 is 1500 CL one minute 2780 Nasdaq 4460 Nasdaq uh, two minutes 2665 all of them those are one thousand dollar target uh, Nasdaq four minutes 1400 400 over the daily target ES we got 775 over the target so it was 1775 most of them hit before even 10 o'clock uh, ES five minutes 1250 ES 3005 minutes The three minutes ES uh, 2400 I'm not gonna go through all of them uh, Russell three minutes 825 two minutes um, 575 this is a scalping one or two contract 1400 on the uh, Russell 1250 uh, on the two minutes you can use it as a scalper or a swing trading and as many uh, es three minutes 1925 oh this one is um is for the scalper uh five minutes this one does not belong to the ti7 but we're gonna cover the scalper as you see here on the chart it says scalper right there this one here uh, shows TI7. This is the difference between two auto trades. On this one here, uh, it was done also at nine o'clock. Took one trade, 720, and it was over. Started around seven, eight o'clock, and done by one trade. And I love that. So we are testing different uh, template. He has four minutes here, 3,900. NASDAQ, five minutes, 2,700. 18, 1,700, 2,800 on the CL. And uh, 1,260 on the YM. And um, on the ES, five minutes, 3,000. Uh, and uh, this is based on two contracts, actually. Uh, now I would like to show a different type of an auto trade and this is very important. This is the latest of the latest scalper we just made. Uh, this one we are about to release right after New Year Eve. And uh, as we see here, CL. One minute, two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. ES, one minute, two minute, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. NASDAQ, one minute, two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. That's how we are testing the new auto trade. YM, one minute, two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. Russell. And this one here we are testing uh, based on a daily target and um, also we are testing it on non-daily 
target as well. As we see, we start from the bottom on the Russell. Um, today, all the Russell did very well. 950 is a $500 target as well. We kept that when the market is going to your favor, it's going to stay. 1630, 1385, those are $500 target, two contract, 605 and 690. On the YM, one minute, 1090, 785, YM, 515, uh, 710, and my. If you notice from the pre previous video, sometimes, uh, last time, as I remember, the Russell uh, didn't make it. Today, it made it. Tomorrow, it might, may, might not make it. I don't know. So, NASDAQ, 920, 1890, 1650, 1980. It was a beautiful run on the NASDAQ today. I want to say thank you very much. And, um, and uh, please be safe. And uh, God bless every one of you. Bye for now.